Good morning, guys. It is day 43 of my keto quarantine. <laughs> slept a little bit better. I woke up at like 5.15 and I forced myself to go back to sleep. So I did finally fall back asleep and then I woke up again at like 7.45. So that was very good. But I'm too lazy to brew coffee. So I had some leftover coffee from yesterday. So I'm just having some iced black coffee this morning. Changed up a little bit. I have my morning. What <laughs> I'm going to show you? I know you're in your underwear. Come on, man. Jimmy just dropped a cup out the window and he's trying to get it with a cane. Oh, it's my pimp cane. <laughs> I can't show them. You can't hat. show my hand. <laughs> Thank you for the shot, babe. Oh, All right, I'm going to do quick blood sugar and ketone measurement. See how I'm doing today. Haven't eaten yet. Um, really need to take these because family is saying my breath <laughs> smells. So usually that means I'm back in ketosis. So these are just like fresh gel. I ordered them on Amazon. I get different kinds. I'm not really loyal to anything. They're little gel capsules. They have like peppermint oil in there because the bad breath from being in ketosis comes from your stomach. So brushing your teeth and flossing and doing all that really won't help at all. All right, so let's do this. A couple things I want to get done today. Ow, my finger's getting sore from doing all these. Um, my roots are really starting to show. I think it's been five, six weeks since I colored them. So I'm gonna to try to do that today at some point after I exercise at some point. My back and neck are hurting a little bit from that stupid Pilates I did yesterday. I just was not doing it good and I did something. All right, let's see, what do we got first here? We got glucose first. I did not like that workout yesterday. Glucose first. We got 99, a little higher than yesterday. Yesterday was 86. Um, I was just vacuuming the whole house. I don't know if that counts as exercise, but I was up and down the stairs vacuuming everything. So maybe, maybe that's why it's a little bit higher than yesterday. So that's 99. Let's do ketones. Point six. Okay, it's a little higher than yesterday. We gotta get this number up to at least a one above. Like I'm usually good at like a 1.5. 2.0 is a little too much for me. It's like 1.5 up to two, between one and two. I'm usually happy. So we gotta work on this. I really didn't do anything bad. I didn't drink last night. I didn't have any like sweets last night. I really step stuck to a good breakdown of macros. I don't know. And try again today. Gotta get this. I'm not gonna be happy until this number is above a one. I'll test again right before I work out. So that workout yesterday with the bands, I did something to my back, right like in the wing right there. Oh. So I'm just gonna do a lower body workout today. Back to this 21 day fix thing. Half hour, get it done.
done. Much better than yesterday. I like that workout so much better. All right, I gotta get onto my laptop now because it's almost 3.30. Four, three, two, one. I don't know why this gets me excited. All right. It says there's three people watching. Nobody said hi yet. So I'm gonna start. Oh, oh somebody said hi. And then when I'm done with this, I'm gonna break my fast. I'm not even that hungry. It's been, I have no idea. I'm gonna check it has to be 18 hours again. I'm not even hungry. Okay, I, I gotta pay attention. So that was fun. I love doing that. Thank you, whoever watched. Thank you. My fam, they always chime in. All right, I'm breaking my fast now. I'll put up the fast apps, fasting apps here. As soon as I'm done, I'm just gonna have a coffee to break my fast, a bulletproof coffee with a little bit of heavy cream and my fat bombs. That's what I'm gonna make because I miss my bulletproof coffee in the morning. I'm getting used to the black coffee, but I definitely don't enjoy it. My coffee used to be like my solitude, my wake up, my first sip, like I enjoyed it. I don't really enjoy it anymore. So I'm gonna enjoy it now. So for my coffee, I forgot about these. I ordered these before I started the uh, intermittent fasting. I think it was like an impulse buy. They probably were expensive. I probably got them on Amazon. I will put a link in the description down below if I did. But it's supposed to have everything in it. Brain boost, age defying, crave controlling, super amazing coffee. And it goes in the Keurig. I'm gonna have one of these. I will let you know how it tastes. I'll taste it first before I add anything to it and then I might add stuff to it because I really want like a good satisfying coffee right now. Uh, calories, 30. All right, we're gonna try it. Carbs, eight, huh? Eight grams of carbs, three grams of fiber. Hmm. Yeah, that's a lot of carbs for a cup of coffee. I'm gonna have to check back in in a minute once this cools off, because I wanna taste it without anything in it. The same thing happened today. It is 4.15 and everybody's eating. Kylie just had tacos. Jimmy's having tacos. While he looks for Turks and Caicos. Looks for Turks and Caicos vacations. What? $10,000? That's insane. What? That's just nuts. Um, I really didn't eat yet. Oh, I'm supposed to sip my coffee. I'm supposed to tell him how the coffee is. Oh, my princess. Sorry, right, to reach in front of you. Okay, my coffee's cool. I can try it now. I'm breaking my fast, 4.15. Oh, you can taste cinnamon. You can taste turmeric. You can taste coconut. Oh, look, there it is. You could taste <laughs> two rooms left. That was the room, Kai. We used to go here every year. Before. Oh, I remember that because I remember doing my homework right there. And you wrote your, your journal oh. to Miss mm -hmm. Kalinsky. Mm -hmm. We used to go every year before James was born. When we were rich. Yeah. <laughs> Not rich. Good. Can we go again? Yeah. That's nice. Yeah, that's nice. All right, uh, I gotta do my fasting apps, break my fast. Yeah, exactly. I would add something to this. I'm gonna, cause I, this is breaking my fast, so I'm gonna add some heavy cream to this. I got hungry making everybody else tacos, so yeah. I'm eating taco meat with cheese and sour cream on a plate. So this is happening right now. I'm using this. And I really just did my roots, and then I'm gonna run it through the rest of my hair. I really feel like this quarantine is gonna totally change the whole economy. Like people are gonna learn that they can do stuff like this at home. I mean, I hope it doesn't. I know me, I'm gonna be so happy to go back to my 
hairdresser and have somebody else do this for me but i think a lot of people are going to realize they can do so much more from home you know they can work from home they can shop from home they can i mean how many people haven't gone to the food store in ages they just order everything instacart like things are going to change for a while all right i gotta leave this on for 20 minutes hair is done roots are done it's black no more grays the top is black and then the bottom is brown well i did more on the roots than i did on the ends thank you all right we are all going Starving. crazy crazy loony stuck in the house again loony crazy james didn't even change his clothes today you didn't even change your clothes today james Kylie's still in her pajamas. I can't. I am making a command decision that we all must go for a ride. And get McDonald's. And the kids want McDonald's because they haven't had McDonald's in how long? Two My months. Year. Two months? My <laughs> Think this out. Don't shake them. They know we live in NYC. So McDonald's drive through is still open by us. So. so we're going to get them McDonald's and get out of here and go for a drive. But you're gonna want to see your car, right? I will probably get a Big Mac and take, well, they sell them without the bread, but I hate being complicated, so I always just order Big Macs and then take the bread off. I have that willpower. I can do it. Thank you. We made it outside. James, we made it outside. <laughs> the outside world, it exists. Yes. That's how well does exist. I kind of see a little bit of sun through the clouds. Tomorrow, 65. Yay. Sunny. 4498. Thank you. Wow. Like you the golden arches. We haven't been here in so long. Open 24 hours, drive through. Just, just pipe down the floor. <laughs> so that did not go over well. Poor James. What happened, buddy? Your belly hurts. Oh, there he is. James's belly hurts. So, I don't know if it was the McDonald's, because he hasn't had that in like two months, or if it was the eating in the back of the truck, because he hasn't been in the back of a truck for a long time. I don't know what it was, but something made his belly hurt, so he's back. Jimmy and Kylie dropped us off. We're back. He's laying down relaxing. So that was not fun because my daughter has anxiety about throwing up and then my son's saying that he feels travel sick, Peppa Pig, travel sick. So she flipped out. <laughs> so she just wanted him out of the truck. That was not fun. I think he's just tired. All right, I'm not gonna say goodnight yet. It's a little too early. Oh, I had two Big Macs by the way. Cause I didn't eat for like 19 and a half hours or whatever it was. So I thought I deserved it without the buns, just the beef patties, but there were four beef patties, two Big Macs. I just snuck out to do one more quick reading. Let's see if anything's changed. I just had those Big Macs. I'm coming, baby. I'm coming. I don't know which one's which. This one's glucose. Let's see if it works. This is the glucose one. 94. Point eight. So that's the highest I've been. I'm gonna do that ratio thingy again. Come and babe. I am gonna say goodnight, guys. I had to lay up here with James, and I was like dozing off. So my last meal was the Big Macs. That was in the truck at like eight thirty. Sorry. 
I didn't get a chance to go down and make coffee or have any snacks or anything. And I'm tired. It's 10 o'clock now. I'm gonna go to sleep. All right, guys, I hope you had a great day. I hope you have a great night and I will see you guys tomorrow. Bye.